Welcome back, fellow Keepers. Welcome back to a, another episode of Legend of Keepers. This be part four of our Let's Play. In the last episode, we finished up our first year by fighting the champion. Uh, I don't even remember her name. Psh, she was just a smelly mortal. We don't really care. She's dead now. We, we don't need to know the names of everyone we kill. Lord, who could keep track? But we now do have Honlet, the big tree beard, which he's kind of fun. Um, so we're gonna, we're gonna put him in. We do need to rearrange some stuff. We finished up the last episode and then went straight into... Well, like, we stopped immediately. Um, so... We're in the next year. So now we get, I believe, an extra... Yeah, we get an extra monster room, but we get a promotion that says everyone in there gets tiredness 3. I wonder which one Monster Room 3 comes from. Does it come from 1 or 2 or both or... Hmm, don't know. Uh, we're gonna go straight into Veterans. Feeling brave. Feeling brave, feeling confident. Let's, uh, let's do it. The marketing team has decided to add a resting area to our dungeons. Interesting. It seemed essential to find a solution to attract seasoned adventurers more efficiently than the competition. Okay. So what does it do? Removes two penalties with most stacks applied from all heroes. Ah, oh, so it like makes it easier for them? Ugh, ugh, stinky. We don't want that. Oh no, not another tracker. Ugh, I hate this. I hate you guys. Um, right, we probably don't want to use a circular saw, but then at the same time... What do I actually have in the first monster room? I don't remember. Not a lot of fire though. I wish you could go back and forward. You sort of have to do everything in order. Um, so you like all nature damage. You're all smashy damage. Ooh, you have the stunning thing. Ugh, I hate it. Wow, so your morales are actually significantly lower than your health now. I guess that's fair. Alright, we probably just throw out the circular saw, because we're going to use the fire trap here. Yeah. It's not going to be very effective, but fucking go figure. Like, what is? I guess we do this. So what do you got? Hang on. So you're weak to, like, ice and nature, you're weak to fire and physical, and you're weak to ice and nature. So ice and nature is our, is our jam at the moment, but we don't really have anything of that in the front thing. We have him for ice, which is pretty good, but I guess we use you for nature, but you're just going to get shot in the back row, aren't you? 65 fire. You only have 66 health. What about fish? You have 70 health. Okay, what if we put you in the back? Oh, you're weak to fire. Oh my god, you're so weak to fire. Jesus, okay. But we might be able to just kill him outright. So maybe we just focus on the front row. Maybe we make this our, our like, nature thing. Are you going to go before... No, you see, you're not going to go before her, and she's just going to kill you. So there's no point doing that. But maybe there is a point in doing that. Yeah. Although he's also going to get shanked by nature damage. Whatever. But I can't think about this forever. Uh, a trap. That's going to be the oil cauldron. Definitely. We know this. It's a thing that works. Now we have... Uh, someone's a bit more punchy at the front. So Stapes at the front. Then I guess... Are you quick? You're not actually that quick. You do have 90 thing though. And you have fire resistance. So that's probably okay. So we do something like this. So he goes first, he slits the one at the front, probably damn near kills him, you shoot the one at the back. Yeah, that'll be fine. And then room three. Oh, so we just get to pick from what's left. Ah, okay. That's kind of cool. Alright, so in that case, we're going to put you at the front. He does nature damage, air damage. Ugh, you're not very armoured, though. Okay, hang on. We'll put you at the front. We'll put our knoll at the front. We'll put Honlet in the middle, and then someone that's strong against fire in the back. 
which I guess is you. Yeah. Actually, why didn't I put you... Why didn't I put you back here? Oh, uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. And then there's us. <laughs> Sorry, lots of thinking here. Right, they get hit by the saw blade. Except for the one at the back. It really doesn't do fuck all. Which, in this case, is fine. You're gonna enrage. You're gonna... Yeah, poison me. Kind of annoying, but sure. He's just gonna fucking annihilate us, I guess. Making... Putting him there sort of pointless. Uh, in that case... Again, I guess this doesn't really matter. You know what? I'm just gonna do that. Because everyone here is going to die. So the more things I can stack on them, the better. That was not a good... Not a good thing. Okay, so he's got burn, he's got tiredness. Honestly, just hit him with the fire whip. He does have resistance to fire. I don't want to enrage you, though. Now, they get a rest site. So it's going to remove burning and bleeding, I guess. Lose two penalties with the most stacks applied from all heroes. Nah, no big deal. Okay, then do we have something about fire? Yeah, like a heat wave? Boom. Oh my god, you guys are going to be so weak to fire. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, if I could get him up the front. Oh, that middle hit, though. Oh. Oh. Oh, that middle hit. No, no, no. Target. Target the wrong. We kill the Barbarian, then the rest of them rest of them die. Oh, wow, you don't have Pierce Through. Or whatever it is. Pierce. Pierce Through some Final Fantasy Tactics. Jesus. Okay, now we're all... Now we all collapse, although I can still tickle you a little bit. He'll be dead as soon as possible, yep. He's nearly dead. And it's gonna be me against this bloody, bloody tracker again. I hate the trackers. Oh, they're so annoying. So annoying. 14 and you take 5% of maximum life. Feels like that'll be enough. So we'll just stink up the back row. I mean, that'll, that'll definitely do it. Right, so you're gonna kill him. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so you hit them with this, then you hit them with that. Okay. Right, I see. Yeah. Yeah, shooting a tree with fire. It works. It just works. It really does. And then once again, it's me against a fucking tracker. And I hate it. I'm, I'm sick of fighting the trackers. They're so hard to kill so irritating. Just die. Taste my whip, you bitch. Okay, power up, regen up, max life up. Nah, more power. More power. Just, just pump the damage. Pump it up. We did get, we did kill veterans there though. They weren't little scrub lords. They were just slightly better scrub lords. Um, do you want a merchant or we take an event? Could upgrade a trap. Upgrade this bad boy again. It doesn't give any more fire weakness, and that's kind of all we want it for, so I'm actually thinking maybe we do this with the bleed. Ooh, or that on the front. Now nah, we'll upgrade... You know what? Fuck it, we'll do both. Fuck it. Fuck it, we'll do both. Alright, then a trainer. Now who do we need to train? Can we not actually train you? Oh, we can. You're just very, very expansive. Um... 
Let's keep upgrading the fish. He's just like a he's just just a solid boy. He's just a good boy. Um no, maybe we upgrade stapes and get get the pierce. If we're gonna end up using him a little more. Uh business trip? Yeah, yeah. Someone that needs a break. Not you. Probably you. Patrol beer? Oh, that's actually not that useful. Maybe send Cirrus. Get some get some tears. We don't often get tears. Uh, are we ready for veterans? Let's see who we're gonna need to pull. We just had to pull a lot of people. Um, Grogma, you're back at the front. You're definitely like my favorite front person. I mean, I guess we have we have the people. Although we're gonna swap Beryl her out for like. Honlet. Actually, because he's pretty good at morale damage, so we could just, like, stack the front one for morale. Couldn't we? Like, we could super stack fucking Demoralize here. Oh, no, wait, actually, hang on. You do... Oh, wait, what am I doing here? Hang on. You, you go there. Um, I think... Yeah, I think maybe we stack the front one for morale. It's like really bad. Obviously we still have Grogmar for damage and he does have morale as well, but we can sort of make an assessment as we go then. Which I think is probably a better choice. Um, give us veterans. Give us veterans. Give it give us your best. Give us your well not your best. Your your second best. Ooh, a Templar. He's fun. Air damage and vulnerable. It's one of her penalties with a bonus at the start of her turn once. That could be annoying. Uh, applies broken armor when attacking. Jeez. Okay, that's a scary one. Hellbringer. The bat gets ice damage. Dodges first trap. The attack... The attack hits all monsters. Damage dealt reduced by 70%. Shit. Okay. Okay, so... We're either going to want someone very strong at the back, or someone very quick, because they're not going to get much of an attack. Um... Also, shockingly, this is a team that has pretty good morale. That's not great. Oh, wait, you have nature resistance. Shit. Oh, no, wait, hang on, it's physical. Yeah, which is basically what, what it's for. Killing killing her. It's lots of nature, lots of poison. Air? How do we feel about that? Ooh. Very strong. Uh, yes, yeah, so that kind of makes you useless, because you're, like, all air damage. Although... No, it doesn't make you that useless. Okay, so we'll actually get those two off first, which I think is okay. Uh, the trap, throw a circular saw in, it'll be fine. Then a spell. Then the rest site. Okay, maximum morale back. Good, good. We didn't... We didn't pick a bad one. Oh my god, then we can heat wave it. Okay, so whoever's at the front needs good air resistance, which I guess is going to be Ronk. Then I suppose we have Beryl Her at the back. So we're going to have Ice and Nature. Oh, wait, Ice. If I put you there... No, he's going to shoot first. It's not great. Okay. Um... Maybe we want you at the back. Who does more fire damage? You do it to everyone. But you just do 60. That's pretty good. Okay. That's probably fine. And then if we still have some fire left over, we'll put Stapes at the front. We'll put Beryl Her in the middle. And I guess, like, Kaval at the back? Or you at the back. Actually, no, we'll put you at the back. That'll be fine. You have Nature and... Ice resistance, yeah? Yeah, you sure do. Okay, good. Then there's us. Brrr, let's go. Let's go. Enough planning. Enough planning. We need to kill. We need to kill. Uh, you're going to shoot the one at the back, yeah? Although, you do have nature resistance. Oh, wait. You do heal someone at the end of combat. Oh, shit. First attack suffered. That's not... It's not bueno. 
It's not Plano at all. Oh my god, that that Hellbringer is going to fucking crush us. Like, I already hate this. That is a damn good party composition that we really can't do anything about. I am impressed you two have survived, though. You're not going to survive now. Like, you're not going to get an action. Which very much sucks. Okay, so we did a little dink on the Templar. That was, like, the grand total of damage there. Oh, uh, okay. I guess we got some bleeds and burning and stuff on the Herbalist, so that's okay. You're gonna get morale back. We don't care. Um, yeah. Whip it, baby. Whip it right. Ugh, oh, you're the problem, though. The fucking Hellbringer. Just damage to everyone. That sucks so bad. Sucks so monumentally bad. Wow, although we're really just... Really just punishing this Templar. I feel bad. Yeah, shit, I forgot that he shoots everyone, so Oromorn is probably just gonna die here. Nice, that's, that's really what I wanted there. Yeah, okay, I think we're gonna target this guy at the front. He- he will probably die. Ugh. Ugh. It's just bad. Okay, do that. He's gonna burn to death, probably. Good. Okay, so the Templar's dead, which means now we can focus on the next one. Which you should, because actually you're about to get toasted, well, frozen by that. Wow, we... Ronk, I don't think you can stun. Like, I think you've put that on your report card, and it's just not true. Oh, okay, oh, sorry, you can get it, eventually. Okay, well, he's stunned, so I don't give a shit about him. He doesn't get to act. Ha! Ah, doesn't work on me. Yeah, hit both of them. We sort of need to. Toast them a bit. Okay, actually, no, this is going pretty exceptionally well. So he's not going to get to act. She's going to be really hurt. They're not going to make it to me. And we may not even lose anyone here. In fact, I don't think we will. No, we won't. Boom, third room. Even with the tiredness. We still managed to stop them actually hurting. Um... Do you want an orc? Do you want another Grogmar? Except his brother Gwag? I don't think so. I think we just take the money. I think we upgrade what we've got. I'm pretty happy with our boys at the moment. Fish needs to go though. So does Kendall. So does Uramorn. So does Seath. So we're going to be pretty short on boys here. Oh, actually, not really. No, no, no. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Uh, we will hit the trainer, though. So, what do you upgrade to? Yeah, more health. Ooh, wow. Better armor, better nature, better air. That's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. We have no money, but I think that's okay. Um, is it triple plunder? Um, we'll do plunder. We'll do plunder, and we'll do something risky that gets us hopefully some sort of. Ooh, upgrade a trap. That's not bad. And this does what? Volunteers get plus two. Next dungeon. Yeah, I don't really want enraged for everybody. We know that there's some people that target that. Uh, Kiara was damaged, but the oil cauldron got upgraded again. Nice. That's what we need. Okay, I don't need an alchemist. We will just take an event. A thigh supplier. Supplies often use some human thighs to feed your employees uh, at a discount price. It would greatly reduce your feeding expenses, and you know that management would grant you a sweet salary bonus. Yeah, why not? 
Uh, I bet you the next event's gonna be like, bro, oh, they all got sick because they were bad thighs or whatever. They were from diseased people or something. Um, Ronk, if I... Ooh, ooh hoo -hoo. Ronk, you could actually be scary with that. Um, Beryl Her gets a new ability. Consumes the stacks of burn applied to all heroes. Why would I do that? Why, why the hell would I do that? No. No, I, I don't want that. Um, yeah, I'll upgrade the succubus. We know she's good for morale. Uh, but we are just going to take some adventurers this month. Or this week. I don't think we can handle veterans with, like, the shitty team we've got left. Um, although I will point out that these guys are basically just as good as the ones we just had. Uh, friends, monsters from coming back to life. That doesn't matter. Uh, can't be affected by demoralized. Okay, so no morale. That's probably fine. You can hit the back with nature. You can hit the front. You can hit the front. Okay, so put Grogmar at the front. You've got air and you've got fire. Okay, so he hates both of those things. <laughs> so let's not put him at the front. Uh, air and fire. That's that's a tough pair to counter. Okay, you're pretty good against air. A little bit weak to fire. You might be okay. And then... We want to target the back, I guess. Uh, yeah, because we have the one that's 50% health after the fight. Such an annoying ability. We don't even have anyone that targets the back. So we might as well just try and hammer... an area, I suppose. Like this? And what, are, what do you target at the back? Nature. Oh, sorry. I should definitely put you at the back, then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then... Someone in the middle of the target's area. Demoralized, not that useful. Or maybe we just super target the front? Although it's not really going to stop anything. I don't like any of these choices, to be honest. We could have done this better. Alright. But, now we select our trap. So what trap do we throw down here? Um, What do we got? Okay, so we got a spell next, and then... Ugh, all here is maximum life. Wow, I'm... I could die here. I could definitely die here. Um, okay, so you have air. We know you put Ronk at the front here. Although he doesn't like fire damage, but go figure, who does? Actually, maybe we want to put the oil. Yeah, actually, we'll go the oil cauldron, because we're going to do that. We're going to hit him with, like, a fire whip at the front. Then we go into, you know, fire team everything. Then we'll hit him with more fire to keep it going. I guess we'll go with the poison dart now to just try and get some sort of damage going. And yeah, I guess this leaves us with not great choices here. Something like that. Okay. I don't feel good about this one. Jeez, good thing I didn't take the veterans. They would have annihilated us. These guys are probably already going to annihilate us. Just impalement? Do you have... Okay. You've got, like, less armor. You're not dead. Somehow. Yes, we have to do this. It's gonna do nothing. It does bleed you, though, which I guess is okay. Uh, yep, more of this. 
Yeah, because they're going to get halfway through my dungeon and then be fine. Like, they're going to go back to being 100%, basically. Like, there's some lava. Oh, you didn't heal. Oh, she doesn't... Yes, she does have that heal. Why did she not do it? Do they only do it if it's actually, like, over 50%? Okay, in that case, this could work out. So you're going to get 30% back. Which is not good, but you're still over 50%. Now, if we can just smash up this one at the front... That's probably okay. And yeah, we just need to target. Target everything with fire. Just kill it with fire. That's our strategy at the moment. And I think that's about all we've got. Damn it. Because if we can kill the one at the front, then she won't heal him. Which we're not going to. Damn it. Damn it. He was so close. Oh, that's... I hate it. I hate that. Okay, we're going to do Heat Wave, I think. Yeah. Just keep pumping that fire resistance. It's like all I've got. At least the Paladin is going to die. That much we can guarantee. In fact, I guess we're going to do this just to be... Just to be... Did he just rip off his arm and throw it? Oh my god, I love it. Poison to everybody. What's your nature resist? Yeah, low-ish. Doesn't really affect the one at the back, but... That's fine. Right, get both of them. Goodbye. You took so much burning damage there, and you deserved it. Okay, I don't want to demoralize. There's no real point. You can't be affected by it, and this late in the game, like, why bother? That's really not what I needed. Yeah, this was a crap team. Like, I, I hated this team. This was actually the worst. Okay, that kind of does nothing right. You can just die. I'm done with you. I am so done with whatever she was. I didn't even look like a sorcerer or something. Whatever. Get out of here. Still a lot of damage, though. Would be interesting to play this and go for... Um... Go for... Old, what do you call it? Like, morale kills. Is anyone full? Okay, so you're full, you need to come back. I guess you can go here, because Ronk and Ulna need to go. Uh, which I guess leaves us you here, and then Laugh in the front. Oh, Beryl Hur needs to go as well, actually. So Laugh will have to go back here. Yeah, sure. Um, we're going to come for the collectors. We're going to give them blood, get extra cash. Uh, right, so this is where we're going to find out what happened to our people. Two employees have been caught red-handed brawling like two elves for a hairbrush. Will you be tough and suspend them for five weeks or threaten them with a pay cut to be sure it won't happen again? I think we're going to have to threaten them. We know what happens if we don't. They get they get killed. Like, one of them will die, which is not, you know, super helpful. Um, Wanda? Find a monster, set a monster free, upgrade a trap. All the volunteers get negative one, which would take him out. But if we find a monster, we're going to get a new one, so that's okay. Okay, we got another... Oh, we got another Stapes. That's going to be confusing. 
Can I can I edit you and change change you? Okay, I guess not. Uh, well, in that case, we're gonna. Uh, you know what? This is fine. Must be a way I can name them. Hmm, don't know. Uh, do we work out? Oh, we have a champion next next month. Okay, we will work out then. Um, do you do all the things? Does that give us max life or no? So that just heals us, which is still probably worth doing. Probably should just do everything. All right. Uh, we are going to save the champion for the next episode, though, I think. So, guys, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see more content from me, the Aussie Nerd, feel free to subscribe to my channel and check out the other videos on there. If you think you know any friends of mine who enjoy my content, make sure you share a video or two with them. I really appreciate it. And finally, if you want to leave any hints, tips, tricks, feedback for videos, or you just want to say hi, make sure you do so in the comment section down below so I can see it. I'll see all of you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.